Okay, so let's uh, just give you a little demo here. Um, the if we add a block to a page, so let's say this is what you've already got on your page. Uh, where are we? Let's find something. So say you've got that on your page, and you want to put that into an editable in the CMS. So you'd go to the code editor, unlock the code editor, then you'd select all the code in there, and then you would go to your page editor. So we'll add a new page content, and we're going to use page four, I think this one, what this one. So page four PHP. Whoops, let's put the dot in. Okay. So we then click the source and replace anything that's already in there with the code we just copied from the the block, the mobilized block. Okay? And go back to source. Now you see we've got everything in there, but it's not quite in the right place. Um, but don't worry too much about that at the moment. But then what we'll do is just we're just going to force that to be black. So we'll change that to black. And then we save it. Okay. So now page four has now been saved. So if we go to our actual site, and here's the page four. So now the CMS content has got exactly what we had in the MobiRise block here. Yeah, as you see, it's exactly the same as uh, the MobiRise block. Oops, wrong one. There we go. Uh, there, with the the same font sizes, and the uh, the button has retained its position and everything as per the MobiRise. Okay, so that's quite quite easy, and it will pick up the MobiRise um, CSS, etc. So let's look at a slightly more complicated thing. Um, so if we go back to Mobirize, now this time let's put a block in that's got an image in. Now this is where you will have some issues because the image won't be the same location. So let's put this block in. Now this block, actually I wasn't going to put that block in. Uh, let's try again. Um, Take that block out in that one. Sorry, that wasn't the block I was going to use. Let's uh, get rid of that. Okay, so let's put. Uh, a block with an image. Uh, let's pick. Here we are, this one. So right, so now we've got that block there. Now we want that block in our uh, as a CMS page. Was, so we've got everything as formatted. So again, we do the same thing. We edit the block, get the block editor, select all, copy, go to the CMS, and this time we'll use page five um, because we've already created that in the demo site. Um, click source again. Replace what's there with our image. Now you'll see we've got everything is in there. Um, right, the the button is not the same size because at the moment it's not picking up the CSS from MobiRise. But we pick uh, force that color. Now the image we're going to need to re-add be because uh, the location is going to be different. So I've already uploaded it anyway here, as you can see. So we'll use that image, and we'll, I think probably 400 pixels will probably be about right. There we go. So now we got that block that we had in MobiRise here. Yeah, it's, uh, it's another one of the bugs in MobiRise that has uh, wiped out the code. So we'll get rid of that. Um, so we've now got that, so we'll save that. And you, you'll notice that the uh, button was not quite the right color. But when we go to the live CMS, you'll see that everything is exactly the same 
as the original Mobuai's block. The color of the button has now picked up the Mobuai's CSS and we've got the image in there. Now the image so is up to you now. You've got more control over your image because you can go into the live page editor and you can edit page five. So you can edit the image and you can make it bigger if you want. So and we'll keep it the same proportions. Okay, so now we've got the image of bigger. So if we save it and now look at the live site. Now we've got the bigger image. So you've got more control over your images. Oh, well, let's save one. Oh, it's gone now. Um, and you, you still retained your links and everything within the button. Um, as you can see, oh, we don't know that's really there. So let's go back. So in the page editor, you can edit that link as well. So you can edit the link there and put your own link in, target, and lots of other things. And you see it's picked up the style sheets for um, movie rise. So it's that simple. I hope that makes it clear to you how you can uh, transfer your movie rise content into the CMS. Um,